So ACDC of Nevada, um, Asian Community Development Council, is donating 100% of the donations from the community um, that we're receiving at acdcnv.org slash Harvey, and we will be donating 100% to o our affiliate partner, OCA Greater Houston, and we want to make sure that um, all of those donations, when we don't have any administrative fees, mm -hmm. um, we're all donating all of that to uh, the Greater H OCA Greater Houston for the survivors in the area. And... Um for um, for the Nevadans out here who are concerned about um, friends and um, friends and family in the Houston area, um, what else is the best way to provide you know to provide that help, or, or even just um, you know try to get a hold of them? Yes. So yeah, obviously, not everyone can specifically donate. You know, not everyone has the financial means to donating. So we want to. We were we were very cognizant of that in our press conference. Mm -hmm. um, so what other things we can do um, is to also provide supplies um, to the affected families. So you can go on OCA Greater Houston's Facebook page, and you can um, go there and uh, figure. Uh, and you can. Um, specifically figure out the location of where you can send those specific supplies. During the press conference, I mentioned um, they're already like filled with supplies, but obviously they need more supplies, such as water, um, clothing for us kids and infants, uh, um, and also making sure that we're cognizant of the food um, there as well. So we're donating food that is also um, Asian American Pacific Islander friendly. Um, so we want to make sure that um, we had that resource with OCA Greater Houston, so visit their Facebook page, number one, to answer the question. Mm -hmm. And number two, how you can best help um, other than financial means, um, please come out to ACDC of Nevada, and we, um, we can also uh, get you in contact with those specific partners in the area. Um, because, of, because of the flooding, uh, people are displaced, and OCA Greater Houston um, uh, is there to help um, the survivors uh, that are displaced. And finally, um, uh, what are you doing um what are you doing closer to home? You know, um, we you know, hear, uh, you know, we've, we've been hearing plenty about uh, na recent natural disasters. Um, well, fortunately, we haven't had any natural yeah. disasters over here. You know, we still have many needs in the community. Um, what is uh, ACDC doing locally? So what we're doing locally is mobilizing volunteers. We're mobilizing volunteers um, in terms of whether that's civic engagement and we're also engaging our AAPI community. So whether that is through events or whether that's you know just coming and stopping by the AC, the, our ACDC community center mm -hmm. to making sure that um, we are of a resource to them. So what we're doing locally here um, is making sure that we have these press conferences to inform um, AAPI, the AAPI community. We have uh, press releases that um, are in inclusive language for the greater Asian American community. Um, and we're also very inclusive, and we're also very cognizant of what our specific efforts are to help uh, our affiliate partners, because our affiliate partners are very are very important to us. So again, like as I mentioned earlier, OCA Greater Houston, um, if they need volunteers, um, specifically from Nevada, we're definitely here to provide that specific support. Um, if we um, need specific, if they need specific donations or they need to um, raise a specific amount because uh, again as I mentioned there is no yeah. administrative fees there's, there's no tax uh, there's no specific um, administrative um, tax uh, as you would mm -hmm. as you would um, so in terms of locally is just really mobilizing and engaging the community to making sure that hey like we need to help out our brothers and sisters and other folks in the Asian Pacific Islander community in Texas